kita theta. So kita ada sin theta equals to okay, uh, opposite over hypotenuse kan y over r. And cos theta equals to adjacent over hypotenuse. So x over r. Then kita ada transformation equation. Okay, jadikan y and x as subject. So ada y equals to r sin theta and x equals to r cos theta. Okay, where r equals uh, is more than or equals to zero and theta between negative pi to pi. Okay, kemudian, okay, daripada ni ada subjek uh, y and x ni. Okay, so kita boleh buat Jacobian matrix. Kita boleh differentiate x with respect to r and theta. Okay, substitute dalam Jacobian matrix and differentiate y with respect to r and theta. So kita dapatlah Jacobian dan kita dapat equals to r. Ni adalah formula untuk pola koordinat. So macam mana kita nak develop formula for uh, pola koordinat. So transformation of double integral in Cartesian coordinate to pola koordinat. So kita ada double integral function f okay, dx dy. Okay, so tadi kita ada in form of uh, Cartesian coordinate. Okay, nak transform daripada Cartesian to polar coordinate. So ada function f ni and function f in terms of r cos theta and r sin theta. So tadi x equals to r cos theta and y equals to r sin theta. Then del x, Jacobian matrix tadi equals to r. Okay, integrate with respect to r and theta. Then uh, kita adalah function, double integral function g, okay, r times r, then integrate with respect to r, then integrate with respect to theta, where r is mapped into the region r under the transformation, okay. So ini adalah formula untuk pola coordinate. Okay, kita pergi kepada example 2.9, okay, evaluate double integral. So dia bagi dalam bentuk Cartesian coordinate, okay. Square root of x square plus y square integrate with respect to x and y where r is the region x square plus y square less than or equals to 1. So kita dah udah x square plus y square ni adalah equation for circle. Okay. Then kita tukarkan Cartesian coordinate ni into polar coordinate. Okay. Example 2.9 A. Okay, given double integral in region R. Okay, square root x square plus y square integrate with respect to x and y. Okay, then given region the x square plus y square less than or equals to 1. Yang kita tahu x square plus y square equals to 1 adalah equation for circle. So x square plus y square equals to r square. r square equals to 1. Then r equals to 1. So kita ada circle with radius 1. So sini 1. Negative 1. 1 negative 1. So circle with radius 1. So kita transform Cartesian coordinate ni into polar coordinate. So equals to, okay, dia bagi double integral. Okay, function f r theta. So kita ada function in terms of r and theta times r dr d theta.
Okay. Kita ada uh, formula for polar coordinate. Okay, transform daripada Cartesian to polar. Then kita ada kat sini square root x square plus y square. Kita tahu x square plus y square equals to r square. So kita tukarkan kepada terms r. So kita ada double integral. Double integral square root x square plus y square equals to r square times r. Integrate with respect to R dan integrate with respect to theta. Then interval dia for R, okay. R dia ada radius. So radius for circle ni 0 to 1. So 0 to 1. Theta, theta ni adalah angle untuk satu bulatan adalah 0 to 2 pi. Okay, angle untuk satu bulatan 0 to 2 pi. Okay, ni kita rearrange balik. So, ada square root R square is equals to R. R times R equals to R square. So, kita double integrate. R square integrate with respect to R then integrate with respect to theta. Then integrate seperti biasa. So, kita ada. Okay, integrate R square equals to R power 3 over 3. Okay, 0 to 1 di theta. Then substitute interval. So, 0 to 2 pi 1 over 3 di theta. And integrate 1 over 3 with respect to theta equals to 1 over 3 theta 0 to 2 pi. Then substitute interval. So, kita ada equals to 2 pi over 3. Okay, kita pergi kepada example B. Evaluate double integral exponent power negative x square plus y square. Okay, integrate with respect to x and y. Where R is the region sama macam tadi. Circle x square plus y square less than or equals to 1. Okay, kita tengok macam mana. Okay, B. Given double integral in the Cartesian coordinate. Exponent minus x square plus y square. Okay, integrate with respect to x and y. Then the region R x square plus y square less than or equals to 1. Dan kita tahu x square plus y square is equals to R square. R square equals to 1 then R equals to 1. So kita ada circle with radius 1. Okay, 1, negative 1. So semua radius 1. Okay. Dan kita tukarkan ni transform Cartesian coordinate to polar coordinate. So kita ada double integral. Okay. Uh, F. Function F in terms of R and theta. So kita ada exponent ni x square plus y square equals to R square. So minus R square times R d R d theta. Okay. For interval pula. Interval Yang pertama, refer to radius. So, kita ada radius 0 to 1. And then, theta ni adalah angle untuk satu bulatan adalah 0 to 2 pi. Okay, then kita integrate seperti biasa. Okay, and then kita integrate. Kita ada dua function of R. Exponent power negative R square times R. So, kita boleh gunakan uh, U substitution method by letting U equals to R square. Then differentiate u equals to du, 2r dr. So kita ada dah r dr. Then equals to 1 over 2 du equals to r dr. Kita transform dalam ni. So kita ada Okay, exponent minus r Minus u. Okay. Sebab tadi power negative r square. 
Okay. And then R dr is equals to 1 over 2 du. Okay, then d theta. Then kita boleh integrate seperti biasa. Okay, yeah, so kita ada integrate 0 to 2 pi 1 over 2. Okay, integrate exponent power negative u is equals to exponent power negative u over negative 1. Then 0 to 1 d theta. Okay, ni kuasa kita boleh keluarkan. So kita ada 1 over 2. Okay, negative. Negative 1 over 2 equals to integrate 0 to 2 pi exponent power negative uh, u substitute back u tadi. u equals to r square. So kita substitute back u power negative r square okay d theta. Okay and ni tadi interval dia 0 to 1. Okay substitute uh, interval so kita ada equals to negative 1 over 2 integrate 0 to 2 pi exponent minus 1 okay minus exponent power 0 d theta okay yang ni pun constant juga exponent power negative 1 and ni exponent 0 equals to 1 pun negative uh, adalah constant so kita boleh keluarkan so ada 1 over 2 times exponent power negative 1 minus 1. Okay. Integrate 0 to 2 pi. Okay. D theta. Okay. So kita integrate equals to negative 1 over 2 exponent negative 1 minus 1. Okay, integrate with respect to theta equals to theta 0 to 2 pi. And substitute interval. So kita ada negative 1 over 2 exponent power negative 1 minus 1 times 2 pi. Okay, 2 kita boleh simplify. 2 divide by 2 equals to 1. Okay, dan kita ada kat sini negative pi over exponent plus negative negative plus pi. Okay, kita pergi kepada example seterusnya. C, evaluate double integral 3x plus 4y square d a. Okay, where r is the region in the upper half plane. Upper half plane. Bounded by the circle. Ada dua circle. X square plus Y square equals to 1. And X square plus Y square equals to 4. Satu ni circle with radius 1. Satu lagi circle with radius 2. Okay, kita tengok. Okay, C. Dia kata upper half plane. Okay, so the first circle, x square plus y square equals to 1. x square plus y square equals to r square equals to 1. So r equals to 1. Okay, the second circle, x square plus y square equals to 4. And x square plus y square equals to r square 4 equals to 4. Then r equals to 2. Okay, so dia kata upper half plane. So kita ada kat sini Okay, ni yang pertama dan yang kedua Okay, yang pertama radius 0 to 1 Okay, yang kedua 0 to 2 radius dia Okay, so the region dekat sini Okay, and then kita convert double uh, kata sin coordinate to polar coordinate. So, tadi given 3x plus 4y square. Okay, d, d, a. Dia bagi macam tu. Okay, so kita nak tukarkan kepada 
pola koordinat. So tadi ni kita ada tadi sebelum dua example sebelum tadi kita ada x square plus y square. So it equals to r square. So yang sini macam mana? So, kita ada x and y. So kita gunakan yang tadi yang first tadi. Okay kita gunakan transformation of pola koordinat transformation equation ni substitute x tadi r equals to r cos theta and y equals to r sin theta. So kita substitute kan dalam ni. Okay jadi kita ada equals to double integral. Okay 3 x tadi r cos theta 3 r cos theta plus 4 y y equals to r sin theta power 2 d r okay, times r. Semua ni kena times r d r d theta. Okay so interval dia okay for r from next 1 to 2. So 1 to 2. Okay and theta theta ni kalau apa half plane 0 to pi. Okay then kita uh, expand supaya kita naik senang naik integrate kita ada 0, 2 pi, 1, 2, 2, 3 r cos theta times r equals to 3 r square cos theta plus, okay ni kita ada r square times r for 4 r power 3. Okay, sin square theta, okay integrate with respect to r then integrate with respect to Theta. Okay so kita integrate respect to R dulu. So kita ada 3 cos theta as a constant sama juga dengan 4. Sin square theta is a constant. So kita ada integrate 0 to pi. Okay 3 cos theta R power 3 over 3 plus 4 sin square theta R power 4 over 4. 1, 2, 2, D, theta. Okay. And kita substitute interval. Yang ni boleh simplify. 3 divided by 3, 4 divided by 4 equals to 1. So kita ada 0, 2, pi. Okay. Substitute 2. So kita ada cos theta times 2 power 3 plus okay, 2 power 4 sin square theta minus okay, 1 pula. So kita ada cos theta jadi minus minus sin square theta integrate with respect to theta. Okay ni boleh simplify lagi. So kita ada 0 2 pi. Okay ni 8 cos theta minus cos theta equals to 7 cos theta plus yang ni 16 sin square theta minus sin square theta equals to 15 sin square theta integrate with respect to theta. Okay. Nak integrate 7 cos theta ni tak ada masalah. Kan integrate cos equals to sin theta. Tapi nak integrate sin square theta ni kita kena gunakan formula. So kita ada formula for sin square theta by using power reducing formula. Sin square theta equals to 1 minus cos 2 theta over 2. Okay, so kita ada kat sini power reducing formula. Okay ataupun boleh refer dekat uh, formula yang saya bagi sebelum ni. So kita ada sin square theta equals to 1 minus cos 2 theta over 2 then cos square theta equals to 1 plus cos 2 theta over 2 and then tangent tangent square theta equals to 1 minus cos 2 theta over 1 plus cos 2 theta. Okay. 
Yang ni kita transform dulu by using power reducing formula. Okay so kita ada kat sini integrate 7 cos theta equals to 7 sin theta. Okay interval 0 to pi plus okay integrate 0 to pi 15 Okay, then kita gunakan power using formula 1 minus cos 2 theta over 2. Okay. D theta. Okay, so kita ada kat sini substitute interval dia sin pi. Okay, sin pi equals to 0. Sama juga dengan sin 0 equals to 0. So, semua ni equals to 0. Then we left dengan integral yang ini. Kita keluarkan constant so kita ada uh, 15 over 2 integrate 0 to pi 1 minus cos 2 theta d theta. Okay then kita integrate equals to 15 over 2 theta minus okay integrate cos equals to sine sine 2 theta then differentiate power dalam dia over 2. 0 to pi. Okay, let's substitute interval. So, 15 over 2. Okay, substitute interval pi. Then sign 2 pi equals to 0. So, minus 0. And 0 minus 0 plus sign 0 equals to 0. So, kita ada 15 pi over 2. Okay, kita pergi example seterusnya. D, evaluate the following. Okay, so, kita bagi dekat sini. Dah bagi dah siap-siap interval. So, kita kena tahu dekat mana. Then, kita transform to polar coordinate. Okay, D. Given double integral number 1, okay, double integral, okay, 0 to 1, then 0 to square root 1 minus x square, x square plus y square dy dx. Okay, so interval ni adalah untuk y. Okay, so interval yang, yang dalam ni adalah untuk y. So kita ada kat sini y. Yang kedua, yang keluar ni adalah untuk x. Okay, so kita ada y equals to 0 and y equals to square root 1 minus x square. Okay, then kita ada y square equals to 1 minus x square. And x square plus y square equals to 1. So, kita ada kat sini circle. Okay, x square plus y square equals to 1. Then y equals to 0. Okay, yang kedua, interval yang kedua adalah x is in between 0 to 1. Okay, then kita lukiskan graph dia, circle. Okay, so kita ada kat sini, ni adalah uh, x square plus y square equals to 1. Okay, tapi interval dia from 0 to 1 saja kat sini je lah. Okay, radius tetap 0 to 1. Okay, kemudian kita tukarkan kepada pola koordinat. Okay, so kita ada double integral. Okay, tadi x square plus y square equals to r square times R, integrate with respect to R, then integrate with respect to theta. Then interval dia, 
Okay, so kita ada radius 0 to 1. Okay, and kita ada kat sini. Kat sini sahaja. So, tadi apa half plane kita ada 0 to pi. Sekarang ni 0 to pi over 2. Okay, then kita solve integral. 0 to pi over 2. Okay, R power 4 over 4. Ni R power 3. Okay, R power 4 over 4, 0 to 1 di theta. Equals to. Okay, substitute interval. So, kita 1 over 4 di theta. Okay, so integrate respect to theta equals to 1 over 4 theta 0 to pi over 2. Okay, substitute interval. So kita ada 1 over 4 times pi over 2 equals to pi over 8. Okay, kita tengok example D2. Okay. Dia pun sama juga bagi double integral. And then exponent power negative x square plus y square dx dy. Okay, transform into polar coordinate. Okay, number 2. Okay, dia bagi tadi uh, double integral ini negative 2 to 2 negative square root 4 minus y square and square root 4 minus y square. Okay, exponent power negative x square plus y square. Okay, dx dy. Okay, so yang ni interval untuk x dan ini adalah interval untuk y. Okay, so kita ada kat sini x equals to square root 4 minus y square then x square equals to 4 minus y square x square equals x square plus y square equals to 4 okay so kita ada equation for circle so r square equals to 4 r equals to 2 then uh, x dia pun sama so ada dekat sini minus plus minus 2 okay so kat sini, lepas tu kita ada uh, interval y, y negative 2, 2, 2. Sama juga dengan radius. So kita ada satu bulatan. Okay, with radius 2. 2, negative 2. Negative 2. Okay, now convert yang ini, Cartesian koordinat ni, into polar koordinat. Okay, so kita ada equals to double integral. Okay, kemudian kita ada ni exponent power negative okay, R square. Okay, exponent power negative R square times R dr d theta. Okay, then kita substitute interval for R. So R radius dia ada 0 to 2. And then kita ada theta, angle for theta, 0 to 2 pi. Okay, yang ni samalah macam tadi kita integrate. The exponent power negative R square times R. Okay, kita boleh gunakan U substitution method by letting U equals to R square. Then DU equals to 2 R dr. Okay, kita ada R dr. So 1 over 2 DU equals to r dr. Jadi substitute r dr equals to 1 over 2 du. Okay. Transform into u. So kita ada 0 to 2 pi 0 to 2 exponent minus u r dr equals to 1 over 2 du d theta. Okay. So 1 over 2 kita boleh keluarkan the constant. So kita ada 2 to 0 to 2 pi 1 over 2 integrate exponent equals to exponent minus u over negative 1 0 to 2 di theta. Let's substitute back u ni 
u equals to r square. Substitute back u. 1 over 2 ni negative. 1 over 2. Okay. Integrate 0 to 2 pi. Exponent minus r square. Okay. Interval dia 0 to 2. D theta. Dia substitute. Dia punya interval. Jadi kita ada negative 1 over 2. Okay. Integrate 0 to 2 pi. Exponent minus 2 power 2 equals to 4. Exponent power negative 4 minus exponent 0 d theta. Okay. Exponent 0 equals to 1. Ini pun constant kita boleh keluarkan. So, equals to negative 1 over 2. Exponent power negative 4 minus 1. Integrate with respect to theta equals to theta 0 to 2 pi. Okay, let's substitute interval. So, kita ada negative 1 over 2 exponent negative 4 minus 1. Okay, 2 pi. Okay, ni 2 kita boleh simplify. 2 divide by 2 equals to 1. Then kita boleh tulis dia sebagai negative pi over exponent power 4 minus minus plus pi. Okay, saya ada lagi example. Yang ni kita kena tulis lah. Okay, yang ni based on uh, past year question. Kita ada ini okay, question on October 2010. Okay, use and appropriate coordinate system to evaluate okay, to evaluate double integral okay, x square plus y square da okay, where r is the region okay bounded by bounded by x square plus y square equals to 9 okey so kita ada kat sini okey bagi circle okey x square plus y square equals to 9 so kita boleh ada lah kat sini x square plus y square equals to r square equals to 9 r equals to 3 so kita ada radius with circle a circle with radius 3. Okay, kemudian kita ada sinilah circle radius 3. Okay. So, in pola coordinate, kita ada interval dia untuk radius 0 to 3 and then uh, theta 0 to 2 pi. So, kita ada kat sini nak to transform into pola coordinate Okay, equals to double integral x square plus y square equals to r square times r, okay, dr d theta. Okay, radius 0 to 3 and then theta 0 to 2 pi. Okay, so then kita solve dia punya integral. Yang ni maksudnya kita ada r power 3. So, kita ada 0 to 2 pi integrate r power 3 with respect to r equals to r power 4 over 4. Okay, interval 0 to 3 d theta. Then, substitute interval. Then, kita ada 3 power 4 equals to 0 to 2. 81 over 4 d theta. Then, kita integrate. 0 to 2 pi. Okay. And substitute interval. 
times 2 pi. Okay, ni boleh simplify lagi. So, equals to 2 kat sini. So, equals to 81 over 2 pi. Okay, ada lagi example. A solid is bounded by the paraboloid. Okay, lagi z equals to 4 minus x square plus y square. Okay, and x, y plane. Okay, A, write a double integral in, okay, Cartesian coordinate means kita ada in terms of x and y, okay, for the, vol for the volume. Okay, tapi tak perlu evaluate. So, kita tuliskan dia dalam uh, in terms of X and Y which is a Cartesian coordinate and B find the volume using polar coordinate. Okay. Kita tengok solution macam mana. Okay, so kita ada paraboloid kat sini. Okay, dekat sini. So, sini tu sini. Okay, so kita ada kat sini paraboloid z equals to 4 minus x square plus y square. Okay, then kat sini z equals to 0. Okay. Then kita ada, daripada, daripada sini kita tahulah kalau z equals to 0 okay, Substitute z equals to 0 So kita ada 4 minus x square plus y square Then x square plus y square equals to 4 x square plus y square equals to r square equals to 4 Then kita ada radius equals to 2 Okay, so kita ada circle Okay, with radius 2, negative 2. So, equation for circle ni, x square plus y square equals to 4. Kita akan gunakan nanti untuk A. So, nak cari A. Okay, kita ada double integral. Okay, function dia bagi tadi, 4 minus x square plus y square. Okay, dy kita buat dy dx. Boleh juga nak buat dx dy. Okay, so kita dy dx. So kita masih ada interval for y dekat sini based on equation circle. Jadikan y as a subject. So kita ada y square equals to 4 minus x square. y equals to square root 4 minus x square. So kita ada daripada sini bawah kan y ni plus minus kat sini. So daripada bawah ni tu atas ni. Okay so kita ada y interval y minus square root 4 minus x square to square root 4 minus x square. Okay interval for x. Okay interval for x kena negative 2 to 2. Okay ni dalam Cartesian coordinate. Okay macam mana pula dalam pola coordinate? B. Okay, double integral. Okay, tukarkan je in terms of R and theta. So, kita ada 4 minus ni x square plus y square equals to R square and then times R dr d theta. Okay, so kita ada interval for R is radius dia 0 to 2 and then theta 0 to 
2 pi. Okay, then expand ni. So, kita ada. Four times r for r minus r power three d r d theta equals to. Okay, integrate four r respect to r equals to four r square over two minus r power four over four zero to two d theta. Okay, substitute interval dia. So kita ada kat sini. 2 power 2, 4, 4 times 4, okay, 16 divided by 2, 8 minus 4, okay, D, theta. So, kita ada 8 minus 4, 8. So, 0, 2, 2 pi, 8 minus 4, 4, D, theta. Okay, integrate. So, kita ada 4, theta, 0, 2, 2 pi. Okay, substitute interval. Kita ada 4 times 2 equals to 8 pi. Okay. Kemudian saya nak masuk kepada yang seterusnya center of mass. Okay, center of mass. A solid object that is sufficiently flat can be regarded as two-dimensional is called a lamina. To find the moment and center of mass of lamina, thin sheets and plate with double integral, we can accommodate a greater variety of shape and density function. The formula as follows. So, dia bagi density, del, okay, in terms of x and y, suppose a particular lamina occupies a bounded region R in the xy plane and let del okay, density be density of the lamina where del equals to m over a. A homogeneous lamina has a constant density. If the lamina is non-homogeneous, its density, k okay, del, varies from point to point depend on the on value of x and y. Okay, so kita ada uh, formula untuk mass. Mass uh, uh, ordinated as m. Okay, double integral, del, tadi density tadi. Then, if del is a continuous density function on the lamina corresponding to a plane region R, the mass M of the lamina is given by, okay, dia bagi dah a formula for M. Okay. Dan dekat sini, the moment of a point mass M about the line X is equals to A, is M X minus A. And the moment of a point mass M about the line Y equals to C is M Y minus C. Then kita nak cari pula the center of mass lamina. Okay, ni kat sini macam mana nak dapatkan formula. Okay, so kita dapat tahulah kat sini center of mass lamina. So M X, okay, the moment of mass with respect to X axis and Y axis are M X ni maksudnya the moment of mass with respect to X axis double integral Y time density okay the A cari berapa then M Y inter, double integral X time density moment of lamina about Y axis then M is the mass of the lamina tadi kita dah formula untuk M okay double integral density okay then the center of mass is X bar Y bar. So, nak cari X bar is equals to M Y over M and Y bar is equals to M X over M. So, kita kena tahulah M macam nak cari mass and then uh, cari moment of lamina based on two axis X and Y and then X bar Y bar is center of mass. Okay, so, dekat sini dia bagi centroid. If del is constant, then the center of mass XY is called the centroid on the region. Okay, the centroid is found by setting del equals to 1. Okay, kita nak dulu example 2.10A. 
find the mass and the center of mass of the lamina of the density del okay, equals to x square that occupies the region R bounded by the parabola y. Okay, dia bagi dua graf kat sini. Y equals to 2 minus x square parabola and the line y equals to x. Okay, so kita tengok macam mana nak selesaikan. Okay, example 2.10. A, okay, given dia bagi tadi density equals to x square. Then dia bagi a region R, y equals to 2 minus x square and line equals to y equals to x. Okay, so kita lukis dulu region ni. So ada parabola y equals to 2 minus x square. Minus x square so graph dia macam ni lah. So kita ada kat sini. Okay, 2 kan, 2, 2 dekat sini. Ni graf untuk minus x square and then y equals to x. So ada y equals to x, satu garis lurus je. y equals to x dan yang ini adalah y equals to 2 minus x square. Okay, so region dia dekat sini. Okay, axis x, axis y. So kita nak tahu point dekat sini berapa dan point dekat sini berapa. Okay. So kita samakan Y. So 2 minus X square equals to X. And X square plus X minus 2 equals to 0. Okay. Factorize. So kita ada X. X 1, 2 equals to 0. So kita ada dekat sini minus. So sini plus minus. So x equals to 1 and x equals to negative 2. So ni kat sini 1, kat sini negative 2. Okay. 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 So kita nak cari mass. Okay. Given mass tadi, formula for mass M equals to double integral, okay, density in terms of X and Y dA. Tadi dia bagi density adalah X square. So, equals to double integral X square. Dan kita buatlah, aku nak buat dy dx ataupun dx dy. Okay, so, kalau kita pilih dy dx, so kita tengok interval Y dulu. So, daripada sini, daripada garis lurus ke paraboloid tadi. So kita ada y equals to x. So from x to 2 minus x square. So kita ada kat sini interval from x to 2 minus x square. Okay. Then inter interval for x. So negative 1 to 1. So negative negative 2. Sorry. Negative 2 to 1. And then kita selesaikan uh, double integral ni seperti biasa. So kita ada negative 2 to 1. Okay, integrate x square respect to y equals to x square y. Okay, x to 2 minus x square dx. Then substitute interval into y. Sebab tadi kita integrate with respect to y. So equals to negative 2 to 1. Okay, sini x square 2 minus x square minus x square times x. Integrate respect to x. Okay, ni kita selesaikan dulu. 2x square minus x power 4 minus x power 3 dx. Then kita integrate. So kita ada 2x power 3 over 3 minus x power 5 over 5 minus x power 4 over 4. Okay, negative 2 to 1. Then substitute interval ni. Okay, so substitute 1 dulu. So kita ada equals to 2 over 3 minus 1 over 5 minus 1 over 4. 
Okay, minus 2, negative 2 power 3 over 3, minus negative 2 power 5 over 5, minus negative 2 power 4 over 4. Okay, selesaikan ni, so kamu akan dapat 63 over 20. Or equals to 3.15. Okay, so dah dapat dah mass. Okay. Then kita nak cari center of mass. Center of mass tadi kita kena cari X bar Y bar. So X bar is equals to M Y over M. M dah ada dah. Y bar is equals to M X over M. Okay, sebelum kita cari X bar Y bar, kita cari dulu M Y N M X. Okay, M X. Formula for M X is double integral Y times del X Y dA. Okay, so kita substitute kan double integral. So equals to Y Del, uh, density tadi x square k dy dx k dari interval for y x square to 2 minus x square interval for x negative 2 to 1 okay, so kita integrate with respect to y dulu so kita ada kat sini negative 2 to 1 x square y square over 2 dan interval x di x saja. Tadi garis luruskan x 2 2 minus x square di x. And substitute interval into y sebab kita integrate respect to y bukannya x. Okay so kita substitute interval into y Okay, then kita ada x square, okay, x uh, 2 minus x square square over 2 minus x square times x square over 2. Integrate with respect to x. Okay, then kat sini kita selesaikan dia. So, kita ada integrate okay, x square over 2. 4 minus 4x square plus x power 4 minus x power 4 over 2 dx. Okay, then kita expand lagi. Was 2, negative 2 to 1. Okay, 2x square minus 2x power Power, ni power 2, yang ni power 4, okay, plus x power 6 over 2 minus x power 4 over 2 dx. Okay, then kita integrate 2x power 3 over 3 minus 2x power 5 over 5 plus x power 7 over kat sini 2. Kat sini kita boleh selesaikan lagi sebab 2x square ni 2x power 4 minus 4x power 4 over 2. Okay, equals to the grade negative 2 to 1. Okay, x power 6 sebab power dia besar dulu. So, yang ni negative 2 minus 1 over 2 equals to 5 over 2. So, minus 5 over 2x power 4 plus 2x power 2 dx. Okay, dia boleh, dan kita boleh integrate respect to x is x power 7 over 2 times 7, 14 minus 5 over 2 times x power 5 over 5 plus 2x power 3 over 3. Okay, interval negative 2 to 1. Okay, then solve for interval. 
substitute interval. So kita ada 1 over 14 minus 5 over 10 plus 2 over 3 minus Okay, yang ini minus Masukkan negatif tu So kita ada negatif 64 over 7 Plus 16 minus 16 over 3 Okay, equals to Selesaikan ni, so kita akan dapat minus 9 over 7 Okay, ni untuk Mx Okay, kita cari pula My my, okay, given double integral, okay, double integral x, del x, y, d, a. Okay, then kita substitute x times density tadi x square, okay, dy, dx. Then interval for y, x to 2 minus x square. Then interval for x is negative 2 to 1. Okay, so equals to kita ada kat sini kita ada x power 3 integral with respect to y is equals to x power 3 y. Okay, x 2 minus x square dx. Okay, then kita substitute interval ni into y. Sebab kita integrate with respect to y. So equals to x power 3 times 2 minus x square minus x power 3 times x dx. Okay, so we have integrate negative 2 to 1 to x power 3 minus x power 5 minus x power 4 dx. Okay, then kita integrate pula with respect to x. 2x power 4 over 4 minus x power 6 over 6 minus x power 5 over 5. Negative 2 to 1. Then substitute interval. So kita ada kat sini 2 over 4 minus 1 over 6 minus 1 over 5 minus... 8 minus 32 over 3 plus 32 over 5. Okay, solve ini so kita negatif 18 over 15. Kamu check semula eh. Okay, so kita ada kat sini center of mass sebab dia minta center of mass and mass. Mass dah dapat dah. Okay, now the center of mass. Okay, x bar y bar equals to m y over m m x over m okey substitute tadi so kita ada m y tadi negatif 18 over 15 over 3.15 okey then m x tadi negatif 9 over 7 over 3.15 okey equals to Selesaikan so kita ada kat sini negatif 8 over 7. Kamu check semula. So negatif 0.4082. Okay so macam ni lah. Uh, nak cari mass and center of mass. So kena tahulah dia punya formula. Okay sampai sini je untuk hari ni. Uh, kita akan sambung uh, Jumaat nanti. So semua boleh buka kamera sebab saya nak kena screenshot. Boleh buka kamera. Okay, saya screenshot sekarang ya. Okay.
Okay, terima kasih semua. Jumpa Jumaat nanti. Assalamualaikum. Thank you, madam. Thank you, madam. Thank you, madam. Thank you, madam. Thank you, madam.